Malta Massey, bringing you the latest happenings in dancehall and reggae music. Welcome, it's Malta Massey, and here are the stories making the cut for today. Apparently, Chronic Law was shooting a music video. Somebody from the team leaked this clip. <laughs> So if you guys watch carefully, in the beginning of the video, Chronic Law was trying to touch her and she regulates him. So it seems like Chronic Law was keeping the same energy when he told her, you know, if it touch me. Anyways, I want to draw your attention to some of the comments in the comment section. Some persons were saying that Chronic Law was being very disrespectful to the girl. Some persons were saying no fat boy couldn't talk to them like that. They would have diss him. While others are defending Chronic Law. Jeffrey then went ahead, reposted the video in his Instagram stories, captioned it. From your gut in a music video, dot, dot, dot. Shrimp, chicken, steak, dot, dot, dot. It's a wrap. I guess Jay Free is saying that, you know, from a girl decide for going a certain type of music video, you're supposed to expect certain type of treatment. Is that the case, Massive? Well, if that's the case, the artists them need to find more creative ways of doing their music videos. The question I want to ask the artist them, in a every music video, if me click pana intense, if me click pana skang, if me click pana raja wild, are the same things I'm seeing. Naked these girls that shake up them body explicit content is it that nobody can be creative enough to think outside of the box give us something else give us something different because we tired eyes we get bored we get bored of seeing the same thing over and over so of course we ask the artist them to be more creative ain't nothing wrong with that and while I'm talking about the explicit content, Shawnee B was in Africa and he conducted several interviews, each of them sending the Jamaican artist the same message. Check this out. Yeah, what I was telling you about the Jamaican music is the dancer, let them keep it real, you know. We like to hear the conscious vibes different from hearing pussy, kaki, pussy, kaki, pussy, kaki. And now the new generation, they only sing about pussy and kaki, which makes me not listen to dancer a lot. But before, like the one that you play on the, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah, listen yeah. to very conscious. I got my wife, I got my children, I sit together with them, play reggae music on my big screen. So sometimes I hate to see very nasty things mm. on the video with my children, you know what I mean? We need to teach the children something that is very important and very wise for their future but not all the time pussy, 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 pussy. You know something? and of course we as parents in jamaica we feel the same way give us content what we can enjoy with the entire family so we can pass down the music to our next generation veteran artist japoni has a message for vibes cartel cartel there is no way you will get free after this case you now get free after this case this is what i tell you now you now i may tell you may I emphasize it for you understand so you can't beat this case mm. it go a privy council you know but you never win a privy council at that foot i talk now but you might, you might talk it lean you never win cartel what you achieve and accomplish is a deal and you need you need now to start contemplate how you're gonna cut this deal because you have to cut a deal there's no other way out one this hype about money you don't have no money to fight the system you don't remember say the system make money. 
you have to work for money. Yeah. So you 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 and the system you know, don't put yourself in front of yourself and fool yourself. You don't have no money to fight the system. Yeah. Now, the only way out cartel, one, how long you that prison now? Eleven years. What have you done within the eleven year in prison? You know, accept no responsibility now. You after you say you mince up lizard fine 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 and him disappear you don't accept that a crime did commit you don't so it's innocent your crime the court already find you guilty the error is that the court didn't go about it right so don't get this thing twisted. You're still a prisoner. It's not about parlor lowing. And it's not about the state. It's about what you gonna do to secure your freedom. And may I tell you now, say, to secure your freedom, you're going to have to cut a deal. Don't make no chatty mouth liar. Tell you, say, you are going to walk without cutting a deal. No. What do you think? You think the government are going to pay you for 11 years with that false imprisonment? They never false the whole year. They never false the whole year. Face the reality. They never false the whole year. The evidence when you already say, Lizard, then can't find him time means so fine, fine, fine. You think that you think that it will disappear? It now disappear, cartel. The only way out with the door catch for you. You already put in eleven years. Now I'm gonna run a deal for you and say, "All right, Mister Palmer, you give me this, and we give you that." So where we are gonna give you? We are going to give you your freedom, but you have to give it, say, eh, me really didn't miss, me really didn't mean something, you know, mm, for my two shoes. God, that it was all about. My, my two shoes disappear and lizard get mean up. Yeah. And after you say that, because that deal you are going to make, you know, them can't go back on that now. But you cannot come out scot free. No make nobody fool you. No make a sack book and a fool you. Well, Massive, if you want to see the full video, head on over to his YouTube channel. According to what Jaboni is saying, if Vibes Cartel wants to be a free man, he must go take a plea deal. And what that means is that Vibes Cartel will have to confess to the murder of Lizard. What are your thoughts? Do you support? Do you agree with what Jaboni is saying? Warrior King decided to serenade his wife on stage, and trust me, I saw my love for say. Check this out. And this is my wife. She's also my manager, my best friend, and everything. Let me tell you something. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid to show the world that I love my queen. No woman in this world could never replace. You know I never leave your side. 
Some entertainers nowadays seem like them afraid for sure how much they appreciate their significant other, especially a woman who got you hella high water, we don't know, who give birth to an offspring, or no afraid for express certain things in song. I saw this article with Tanya Stevens as well, who is saying more male artists are to express their softer side. The article reads, legendary reggae artist Tanya Stevens believes hardcore for dancehall hitmakers possesses a quote-unquote softer soulful side and are capable of expressing emotions other than the aggressive persona some tend to portray. However, she said more entertainment spaces are needed for the artists to expose their talents at more live acoustic events. She said, and I quote, we need to start give the youth them a chance. We need to create the space and invite them in and give them a chance to showcase that side of themselves. The space is a code switch space where artists can come and express their other sides that nobody allows in hardcore dance hall. Tanya Stevens encouraged the artists to show we say you have feelings. You're a good man and you're loving too, apart from your bad man and your chop. Show we say can massage and rub down and if them in the space, then we show you. But we not give them no space to express that. She continued by saying, suppose we did walk over to them and hug them. No hug them I go hug your back. So if you thump them, them I go thump your back. Give them where them get. There's more to the article, but you get the gist of what she's saying. And I agree. Nothing wrong with showing a softer side. Vibes Cartel showed a softer side. Bounty Killer showed a softer side. Being a man showed a softer side. And the young artist them finna say it's okay. And there should be spaces for them to express this side as well. What are your thoughts, Massive? Let me know in the comment section below. Have you guys seen the video with Popcorn and the police in a bit of altercation? Well, if you haven't, here goes. Shortly after that, it was reported that the St. Andrew North Police are investigating an incident which happened over the weekend involving dancehall artist Popcorn. Superintendent Sharika Service, who is the head of the division, confirmed the incident which happened along Constant Spring Road. However, she did not give any details. Popcorn then took to his Twitter account to say this, Many are called, only few are chosen. I am a creation of God's greatness. I don't fear and I know no failure. Don't let nothing break or distract you from your path of greatness. I don't need to explain myself to people. Think whatever you want. Have a nice Monday. Hashtag unruly state. So that's it for today, Massive Mountain. I beg up on a nice, clean self. Enough love, enough respect. Blessings upon blessings upon blessings. Positive vibrations going out to the Massive. I'm out of Massey, Magan. Mount Massey. Mount Massey. Covering the latest in Jamaican music and culture. Like, share, comment, and subscribe now. now. now.